Okay, so I'm here at all of these. Okay, right, these. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> We're coming in here to see some vegan finds. So I've been to the whole store so far, and this is all I've seen. Um, just the frozen ones and my local one. Um, I think I want to try this Asian veggie burger though, because I do love like Asian flavors and stuff. So I think we'll put those up, but I'm not excited about anything else. Okay, I found cream cheese also. Um, I'm not gonna get it because I really don't want it, but it's very free. And then of course they have tofu, which is 69, which is cheaper in my opinion than going to like um, Walmart for it. They have the firm, extra firm. Yeah, that's it, firm and extra firm. So, yeah. I also have this. Uh, these mini cups of hummus. I bought hummus last week that I last week that I did not finish, so I'm not gonna get them. But these are really good for snacks, I guess. Yo front, come in here and there. This is not a part of the vegan haul, of course. Eight of them. I'm gonna get them for my babies. Okay guys, I'm done at Aldi. I did not find all the things that I wanted to find. I Aldi didn't have. I was really looking for the pot stickers. I was upset that I could not find them. So I'm gonna do a good old fashioned trunk haul. Um, of some interesting stuff that, stuff that I did find. Um, of course, the most vegan things that I did find at Aldi was in the produce section. So I'll show you that stuff first. Um, I got celery, of course. Of course. Um, I'm going to be making some chicken salad, but it's not really chicken. It's I'm using chickpeas for that. And I think I'm going to show the recipe for that this week, hopefully, if I can get to it. Um, of course, strawberries. You guys all know how Rachel and Ryan love their berries. Um, other kids do too. I got some almond butter to do some overnight oats with. Um, I'm trying to find my vegan, my vegetable, more healthy stuff. I have other things I'll show you in a minute. Mushrooms. I like to put mushrooms in my vegetable um, stir fries because it gives it more of a, um, like a whole, like a more, what do you call it, like a more meatier texture without having to use like um, soy. Um, I'm trying to stay away from soy and soy is a treat for me so like last night I had General Tao's tofu which is you know soy a soy product um, I got some penne pasta um, I got some sweet potato some sweet potato chips I did show you this inside the store the Asian um, burgers yeah I'm totally out of focus like this sun is just hating on me today like whatever son all right um of course I'll show you my card because that'll be easy uh, to see and then we can get it done a little faster okay so I got bananas bananas for Rachel Rachel would you like a banana yes Rachel loves bananas they're like her she loves fruits and I love that about her I opted not to get white potatoes this week and I got sweet potatoes I think I ate too many white potatoes this week I got some onions down there um almond milk there um, of course my family isn't vegetarian or vegan they eat whatever they would like to eat um, I do, if I make something, I heard that these are vegan, is that true? Yeah, gotta look at it, I did hear that before. Um, the ingredients are, uh, you can pause it to see, but bleach, uh, unbleached, flour, blase, 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 blah, yeah, I mean, I guess they are, but I mean, I'm sure they're made in factories where they are process other things but for me that's really it um and i'm gonna go through actually my meal plan for the week and my for my food this week i'm gonna put a video up about that um if not tonight tomorrow so i know i'm doing that but besides that let me get all this stuff in the car so i can get stuff back in the car so i can get home and continue on with my day actually wound up finding these meatless meat boys they're made with um, vegan meatballs with soy protein Can you see that yeah soy protein garlic and parsley so yeah that's that 
that's the only thing I found. Um, and the serving size is six meatballs, and it has approximately six servings. So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm sitting here actually and for dinner I decided to have some pasta and I used the vegan meatballs that I got from Aldi today and they are so so good like they're good I mean I can't not want to sit here and be like they're like you know the best thing ever they taste just like your mama's meatballs because they probably don't but they're really really good I wasn't expecting them to, um, to taste that way so Yes, I like them. I really want to find the pop stickers. Like, I really, really do. So, hopefully, I do find those. Right now, what am I doing? I'm working in my Erin Condren planner. And I'm starting, I'm actually trying to, starting to like it more as I'm using it. And so, I might do an updated video on that. Not right now, but later. Rachel's trying to pull my stuff. With that being said, I'm going to end today here with my um, Aldi vegan finds blog, vlog, whatever, yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna stop because I'm being climbed on by Rachel. She's climbing on me, can you? Okay, let me let her say hi because, hi. and Rachel, and can you say hello? Say hello. There's, ooh, okay. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. If you did, let me know. I'm gonna finish my food and finish planning my week and all that good stuff so thanks so much for watching oh update on ryan ryan is you say bye ryan's doing better he's eating he had macaroni and cheese for dinner actually and he ate it all so i'm very happy about that he's drinking more so he's trying he's still sleeping a lot but that's fine so, that's it thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my videos um yeah that's it So I'm sitting here eating dinner. That's something I wanted to say and I forgot to say when I was in the store. And I know I'm like probably preaching to the choir, but when you eat like vegan, vegetarian, any other types of diets, the best way to eat is not always opt for the convenience options. There, there's good to have them because it's last minute things and you, I think it's good to have last minute items, but your best bet is to focus still on your produce aisle. Like that is the vegan road light aisle if you're like wanting to have um what's it called organic things and you're like a little pricier but I mean you walk into the store and the first thing you see is a produce owl and you just saw that stuff in there and saute some crap and there you go so at the end of the day yes there are lots of convenient foods and things like that but the healthiest bet is to just stick to your whole food type items that you have to make <laughs> and that's all I wanted to say with that so thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and finish this app pasta before Ryan pulls it down and yeah this week I'm going to be eating more whole foods because yeah oh my gosh the lighting is horrible see you guys tomorrow bye